Hey guys, I'm here again. Um, it's already late in the night, but I decided to record uh, one video more about gratitude and how important it is to be aware if you are uh, grateful for what you have in your life or not, and how to attract um, the abundance in your life but when i'm talking about abundance i mean abundance in in your uh, love life abundance in your financial life and abundance as well so in in your business and in your um relationships in general with with your family and and environment yeah so this is the uh, channel the power of your mind with Monica Sevan and as I mentioned it, uh, previously uh, today I'm going to talk with you about gratitude and how important it is uh, to be gr uh, grateful for what you have in your life before you get more and before you attract abundance you have to learn to be grateful for what you have at this moment and why you don't attract gratitude or why you have um, a black period. So that's why I, I, how I call. So, you know, every one of us has black periods in life. I, with black periods, I mean, there are periods uh, in our life when you plan something, but you don't get done from that or every time so uh are appearing difficulties or obstacles yeah so i i call this kind of of obstacles like a black period yeah and if you are not aware of the fact that you have to to be positive so you have to before you attract um abundance in all the areas of your life even if it, um, it concerns your relationships with your family, uh, environment in your business, um, or if it, it concerns uh, the abundance in, in your financial uh, situation, before you attract that, you have to be grateful for what you have acquired for your current life. Even if you have lost something, there is always a reason why is that happened. Yeah. Before you get something future, you have to give something. So you have to lose something. This is the, the law of the nature of the universe. And call how you want, but is this is the way how it works. To get something bigger, huger, you have to give something in return. Don't forget that. And even if it's happened, so be grateful for about that. It means that so the universe or God so is preparing for you a, a better plan, so a huger plan for your life. So it means that you are meant for more. It means that you are worth much more than you have. And that's why you have to be very, very grateful. If you believe in God, so I am my Christian Orthodox, and if you believe in God, be grateful for everything that you have created in your life. If you wake up early in the morning from your bed and you are alive and you can look so uh, um, outside just be grateful for that if you are sitting at the table together with your family appreciate that appreciate that you have a family because there is many people there are many people in in this world that they don't have a family they want to have that but they don't have the are ready to do everything to, to get a partner, to get children, but you don't get that. So just learn to be grateful if you have a family. Learn to appreciate what you have. 
even if you have a relationship or sometimes so you have difficulties or you you are facing uh, obstacles just connect together to facing it together and be grateful that you have each other so in your relationship be loved to each other yes just show love and kindness towards each other i i'm always grateful for the fact that i i'm still a living that i'm i'm alive and that i can embrace so my daughter all my family because i have had a very bad experience i have seen the dead so then you can imagine how grateful i am that i'm still alive that, that i i still can see the sky that Girl, in the morning I can wake up. That I can admire some my my daughter. That I can admire my family. Just be aware of these uh, valuable things that we cannot buy. You know the the most important things in our life are for free. Kindness. A smile, a look, just when you, you, you have a look at someone. Doing uh, good things, be helpful towards people who truly need you. It doesn't cost nothing to be kind. It doesn't co cost nothing to be grateful. These are are all aspects where you have to pay close attention before you will uh, get the abundance. And that's why you have to be grateful, to, be, uh, to learn to be grateful for every single moment of your life. If you are not happy with your life, just change it. Take action and change it. So you have to be aware of your actions or what's needed to do to change your life. And if you um, have the ability or you have a talent, just be grateful for that. Because there is people who is born with um, a very strong talent that they don't need to work uh, too much at their talent. If you are one of them, as be grateful about that, that you are so talented, that you are born, that there is given a gift to you from God, from the nature at your birth. Learn to be grateful for that as well. Or if you have certain um, personal qualities as a human being as well, learn to be grateful, pray for that. And, and say it every single morning when you wake up, I'm grateful. Oh God, thank you that I'm alive, that I'm with my family. Thank you so that I can open my eyes, that I can take a breath, that I can show up in front of the people like me. So right now, I'm very, very grateful uh, that I got this, this huge mission to can guide you towards happiness, towards awareness. Show your, your kindness, your love, your, your big heart. That's, that's what matters. When you will do things with love and kindness, then everything will come back to you. That's where you have to be aware of. If you only ask, 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 and you, and, and you always are pretending and you don't want to give nothing in return, you will never get nothing. And, and it's, it's awareness, it's leadership. So you have to master the skills within you if you recognize yourself so in, in, in my example. That's how it works. Before you get something, you have to give it. You have to share something, you have to share kindness, you have to share love. You, if you want to get, you have to care about another people. Is the law of attraction. 
what you give, you, you, you get in return. It, it doesn't take so much to create that. All, only attention and careness and kindness and love. Everything, all this is for free. I think that it, it makes huge sense. All, all these, these qualities are for free. You have all these qualities within your cellar, but you have to jump in so inside of your inner, of your heart, um, to, to be a little bit with yourself, to take time to reflect on, to analyze why is everything going on like, like in that way, how is going at this moment, and what have you learned from, from that situation? And just be grateful for every single second of your life. Because believe me, there is people that don't have absolutely nothing. They don't have even something to eat or, or water to drink. So learn to appreciate everything what you have in your life. Now I have seen very, very poor people, incredible uh, poor that they uh, don't have even something to eat. And I always, so I, I'm, I always love to help people, but truly with love from the depth of my heart, because I care, because it touched my heart. So, and I care for the people. I cannot be indifferent towards the people. So it, it's like, it, it's very painful to me when I see children on, on the street that they don't have nothing to eat. I have been traveling a lot and in different countries. I saw people on, on the street or single moms, especially in Turkey, in Syria, you know, on the street. You see moms with four or five children on, on, on the street. And because of the war, they lose everything. And they are there on the street with a house, with, uh, with, without food, with, uh, without a job, with nothing. That's what you have to realize. And they are still grateful, the people about it. Yes, they are grateful. They have worked all their life. They have studied as me uh, or, or as you. They have done their best to build up their life, so to, to educate their children. But because of the war, they lost everything in their life. And only the fact that they are still uh, alive, that they are living, so they are very, very grateful every single second. I have realized as well uh, a project about so immigrants in Turkey and Netherlands. And it's, it's, so there are um, situations um, which are disastrous, but truly terrible. So that I, I got only a heart age because the situation of the people, it's so, it's so terrible. And, and it's so, it, it's so um, hopeless. Because they don't have probably probably nothing. So just be grateful for for everything. Just just look around you, um, analyze your situation, just analyze your faults as well. Because if you owe something in your life, so it means that probably you have paid for something for your mistakes, because that's that's the life. If we made huge mistakes, so you pay for that. And especially when you are not aware of, of, of the fact. And this is the law of attraction, you know, uh, not without reason. So <laughs> um, it said that uh, karma is a bitch. 
what you get, what you give, you get a return. Probably much more later, but everything what you are doing in your life, it comes to you back. Remember that, don't forget, it's very, very important. So what you are sharing with people, that's what you will get back. If you are sharing positive emotions, positive moments, if you are empowering and helping the people, if you are motivating and inspiring the people, it means that you will get back the same. You will be helped, you will be blessed. And be grateful with love from the depth of your heart. If you don't know, so what, what does it mean to be grateful? Just master the scale because it's about mindset, the way how you think. I remember that everything starts not only from your mind, but as well from your heart. When it comes to, to, to gratitude, Yes, the rationality is important, but love and kindness is as well very, very important in our life to be kind towards the people. And when you will show um, a kindness, you will, be, you will be blessed from God. Remember this. So I want to, to thank you, um, for watching this video don't forget to like and to subscribe to to my channel um uh, the topic of today so it's about mindset and to master and to shift your way of thinking but as well to learn how to be grateful to be grateful for all the efforts that you have done and are still doing but as well to be grateful uh, for the people who, who has helped you in your life and has contributed to your growth. Be aware of that. Take care and I see you soon. Bye-bye.